Home sales in Southern California were down last month as home prices were up by 20 percent from the same time last year, says a new report by DataQuick. Joining me with a closer look at San Diego's housing market in 2014 are real estate economist and market researcher Alan Nevin and Alan Jin, economics professor and author of USD's Index of Leading Economic Indicators. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Alan Jin, let's start with you. The Federal Reserve is expected to raise interest rates. If if they do so this coming year, what kind of impact could that have on San Diego County's uh, housing market? I think that uh, it won't help uh, because it'll make uh, the cost of buying homes uh, higher, but uh, the rates will still be near historic lows, so, so I don't think it's going to be enough to derail the, uh, the rebound in the housing market. Who would be impacted most by this? Uh, are we talking about lower to middle uh, peop income people who are trying to buy uh, that price range or are higher? Higher people are across the board evenly. I think uh, it'll impact all all buyers, but uh, particularly people at the lower end, where where they're just scraping by for to to, to afford uh, their their monthly payments on housing. I see. Okay. And Ellen Nevin, how important is resale uh, to San Diego's uh, the resale market in housing to San Diego's overall housing recovery? Well, as we're not building many new ones, it's really paramount. In, in, in where we, we will sell this year about 40,000 resale units, which is really quite good, and do the same next year as well. What do you expect to see as far as um, in these resales? Do you think with the interest rates going up that it's going to be more of a, a seller's market? Well, I think it is a seller's market. Already? Already. Mm -hmm. Any other predictions for the resale uh, market in 2014? I just think there will be spirited competition for homes. Uh -huh. Okay, I, I detect a little note of uh, predictive advice for that. Alan Jin, um, where do we currently stand as far as the number of foreclosures here in the San Diego market? They're down considerably. Uh, what's, what's happened is that a lot of the distressed homes were were foreclosed on uh, early in, in the downturn. But what's happened now is that with ho housing prices rising as rapidly as they are, now we have fewer people who are under wa uh, underwater in terms of their mortgage, and so they're holding on to their homes. And even if, even if you're still underwater, you see these, these prices rising, you have hope that, that, they'll ri that they might rise enough to, to put you back uh, uh, above water. And so as a result, there's been a big drop in terms of distressed properties, and that's reduced the supply of uh, single-family housing on the market. Do you think that uh, once the, the market rates do come back up as far as foreclosures or, or um, I won't, don't want to say foreclosures, but people considering short sales that they might say, now is the time, we've been waiting, like the second the, uh, the balance is tipped that these people will turn around and sell their houses? It, it's possible. And so at that point, there will be more houses than uh, on the market. But uh, again, they won't be at the distress levels uh, that, that we saw uh, just a couple of years ago. Okay, and uh, Alan Nevin, you, uh, what have you seen as far as in terms of new construction here in San Diego? Uh, negligible. We're, in terms of sale housing, back when we were doing 9,000 single family new ones a year, and now we're down at the 2,000 level, and there's no signs that that's coming back because we don't have lots ready to go. What are we losing when, um, in that big jump, you know? by well, not having it. We are losing the ability to provide moderate price sale housing. Mm -hmm. So uh, the ones that are being built, are they upper end houses then? Almost all over 700,000. What does this do as far as our economy? Um, is, as far as when you don't have home construction, new home constructions like we did before and it's down this significantly, what kind of impact does it have on our overall economy here? Well, it's a major impact because new home construction has a very large multiplier effect economically and creates a lot of activity. And we are off right now about 40,000 construction jobs from historic highs back in 2006. Okay, and uh, let me start with you, Ellen Jen. In a sentence, if you had to say your outlook for San Diego's real estate market in the coming year, what would it be? It's, I think we'll have a solid market because the economy is gonna do relatively well in 2014. We're gonna get good job growth. Interest rates might rise, but still be at, at relatively low levels. Buy if you can? I, 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 would, I, I would say yes. Okay, and Ellen Nevin, how about you? 
Well, I agree with Alan, and the distress is not in the housing market. It's going to be the buyers who are going to be in distress because they're going to find the prices will continue to rise. Okay, Alan Nevin and Alan Jen, thank you so much. It's thank a you. pleasure.